All right, folks, we are going down. Bitcoin is going down to Chinatown. I did a video yesterday saying, hey, look, stocks are crashing. Bitcoin's not crashing. Bitcoin's kind of acting weirdly. But I also said we'll probably get up to about $31,000 and then we'll shoot right back down and get rejected. Because there's no way that Bitcoin's not going down to be between twenty dollars and $25,000 at some point. It has to. I mean, there, there's nothing bullish in the markets right now. Um, and it looks like that's what's happening. We just had about a $2,000 crash in Bitcoin. Um, so, you know, I, people just need to realize $25,000 is inevitable and $20,000 is probable. So, <clears throat> meaning there's no guarantee we'll get down to $20,000, but I certainly have money on the side, right, to pick up my Cardano at 25 30 cents if we do. But I think $25,000 Bitcoin is basically guaranteed. Um probably see a giant bounce from there, but it's happening. It's happening. So very exciting times. Yeah, yesterday was kind of an outlier. It was kind of weird yesterday because the stocks were stocks were crashing. Bitcoin was kind of going up, but sometimes that happens. You know, Bitcoin sometimes goes off its own, on its own path and does its own thing, and then it kind of reverses course and goes right back aligned with the stock market. <clears throat> stocks are down today. Uh, stocks actually started higher and Bitcoin was doing okay. And then all of a sudden, Bitcoin, uh, stocks turned negative and Bitcoin immediately crashed $2,000. So <laughs> you can't make this stuff up. So everything's, everything's basically taking a little bit of a dumper right now. <clears throat> oh, Cardano back down to 50 cents. Um, yeah, 30, 40 cent Cardano is, is a coming. It's coming pretty soon. I mean, Let's think about it. Bitcoin at $25,000, I'd say you're going to have Cardano at about $0.38. Cents. $0.40, cents, $0.38. Cents. Bitcoin at $20,000, I think you're going to see Cardano at $0.25, cents, maybe $0.25 to $0.30. Cents. The whole hard fork, the vast school hard fork coming up next month might help prop it up a little bit. But folks, you're going to be able to get some cheap-ass Cardano, and it's very exciting because you're going to see $10 to $14 Cardano in the next couple of years. But I just want to make this quick video. There's really nothing negative in the market other than the stocks are crashing. That's pretty much it. And, um, you know, we're going into a weekend, which is always dangerous because the stock market is not trading. So this could be the weekend where we get that dump back down to uh, $25,000. So, you know, people, get, people always get bullish when Bitcoin pumps up a little bit. And I'm always skeptical, um, especially when everything's so bearish. Folks, the world sucks right now. Stocks suck. Real estate sucks. Bitcoin sucks. Even gold is down. So we just need to get it. We need to flush down to $20,000. $25,000, I'm still going to be saying we're going down to twenty, <clears throat> But $25,000 could have been the bottom. I'd, I'd say it's a 50% chance that $25,000 was the bottom. But um, if I had to bet on it, I'd say we're going to be $19,000, $20,000 at the bottom. And then see a shoot up from there. I think we're going to get our Ethereum. $1,500. If, if Ethereum drops below $1,500, I'm going to pick some up. I had a bunch of Ethereum in 2018 through 2019, and I sold it way too soon. But I also put a lot of it in Cardano, so it worked out okay. <clears throat> Let's see what else we got going on here. AVAX, 20. Ooh, 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 ooh. Man, AVAX is... Uh, AVA, AVAX under $20. I'll be picking some up. I mean, the market just absolutely sucks. Oh, and I just picked up some MetaHero. MetaHero was uh, 28, 26 cents in the bull market. It's now now down to about a penny, just over a penny, a penny and a half. So it's down 90, 97, 98%. Any, anytime there's a coin that you believe in and it's down 98%, probably time to pick some up. Now, I think MetaHero could drop to a half a penny, and I'll pick up some more. But uh, I think a penny and a half is a pretty good price for a coin <laughs> that was... Uh, 26, 27 cents just last year. So folks, the opportunities are here. This is a very interesting time. Don't get depressed. I'm excited. We knew we were going to dump. I mean, I watched my video yesterday. I said $31,000, $32,000, then we're dumping right back down to $28,000. And that's what's happening. The market at this point has gotten predictable because everything is shit around Bitcoin right now. So there's no way it's going to go bullish. Now, eventually... Eventually, we're going to hit recession, the stock market's going to bottom, and everybody's going to come flying back into the stock market. You're not even going to believe it. It's going to be, you're going to see days where the stock market's up, you know, Dow's up 2,000 points. It's just going to be flying. And what do you think is going to happen to Bitcoin at that point? If Bitcoin's at $20,000, you're going to see Bitcoin go up to $30,000, $40,000 overnight. So 
these depressing times never last. This is when you buy to be a millionaire in two years. And it sucks because we all have a lot of money in crypto. You're seeing your net worth go down, so you feel like you can't spend anything. Inflation's up. Gas is $5 a gallon. I basically feel like I'm poor because, you know, <laughs> I felt rich last year. And this year, you feel poor because everything's down. My stocks are down and my crypto is down. But this is the time to be buying. That's why you have to have that money on the side. So we'll see what happens. I just want to get that flush over with. Pay attention this weekend, folks. If we see Bitcoin close under $28,000, $28, it, it, I mean, that $25,000 dump is coming soon. And then if we're hanging out at about $25,000, $26,000, a flash crash down to $22,000 or $20,000, it's happening. Unless the stock market reverses, you know, reverses course. But, you know, with the stock market, you get your, ups, your up days and your down days. But for the, most, for the most part, the stock market is bearish. You get your little dead cat bounces, which basically prop up Bitcoin a little bit for a couple of days. But that's it, folks. It's not going anywhere. So that's pretty much it. There's really no news, good or bad, except for the market suck. And um, look for your deals this weekend. Like I said, I, got, I already got my, a bunch of Cardano at uh, 40 cents, 38 cents. My next big buy for Cardano is 30 cents. Oh, also VeChain. If Bitcoin dumps down to um, 25, 20 thousand dollars, you're going to be able to get Bit uh, VeChain for like a penny, maybe a penny and a half. Remember, VeChain was 25 cents last year. Easy 25, 30x for VeChain. Easy, easy, easy. I mean, you put a thousand dollars, two thousand dollars in the VeChain at a penny, that's fifty thousand dollars if it goes back to all-time highs. And I think next bull market, VeChain will hit 50 cents. But I will be selling most of my VeChain when it gets back to all-time high of 24, 25 cents. So the deals are there. Lots of deals in the metaverse right now. Like I said, I just got my MetaHero. And uh, Vulcan Forge will be under $3 before you know it. I'll be picking up some more Vulcan Forge as well. So it is a risky time to buy altcoins, but look, man, they're down 95%. Now's the time to do it. If your altcoin's down 90 to 95%, there's no reason not to pick any up at this point. 